Hi, this is Wade Harvey, and welcome to IdealProgrammer.com, where you'll find over 300 hours of free .NET video tutorials that you can watch on a DVD player, TV, or computer. Uh, today we're talking about modern software development in VB. Uh, but before we get started, I want to say a quick word about the uh, general philosophy of the blog. Uh, in uh, philosophy, what you find is that uh, for every actual th thing, there's an ideal that we have, which is a mental picture in our minds of what the actual object should be. And when the actual object uh, is different from the ideal, it creates a tension within us. And the way we reduce that tension is by performing a massive action to transform the actual object into the ideal. This same concept applies to our individual self uh, and our actual self. When, uh, we, when we fall short of our ideal, we feel a tension in us, and this tension is the strongest uh, tension that we experience. I, by strongest, I do not mean uh, the most intense, I mean the most enduring. Uh, anger or some basic need like hunger or so forth can overcome it for a short term uh, but uh, in the long term uh, the tension that we experience between our actual self and our ideal is the strongest so w on this uh, website what we're trying to do is present uh, ideal models for how to do programming and uh, give us some actions, specific actions that we can take to help transform our individual self and to become more like our ideal self. So let's click on the Modern Software VB link and go to the uh, video series. And here you have 15 free videos from Joe Hummel who is a, uh, a doctor in computer science. The first video that we're talking about is uh, program execution in the 21st century and this uh, shows brilliantly how Joe got his uh, PhD in computer science by giving a very crisp and clear uh, description of the CLR in the uh, framework class library and he it compares the CLR to Java's uh, Java Virtual Machine he says in uh, ASP Net uh, 2.0, the registries no longer used to indicate where the assemblies reside. Instead, uh, it's a, a technique similar to the old DOS uh, path uh, technique, or where you have a path that it goes first through. First, the system looks in the GAC uh, for any assemblies. Then it'll uh, look in any places indicated by the config file, and finally, it looks in the folder where the executable for the VB. Uh, program resides. So please come to um, uh, idealprogrammer.com to view this two hour video from Joe Hummel. Uh, thanks so much.